Hello everyone, welcome to Mathematics Tutorial. So today we will continue our discussion. It's all about operations and functions, but we will focus on difference. It is the result of subtraction. Subtraction. Okay, so the formula in finding difference of the given functions is uh, f minus g times x equals f of x minus g of x okay let's proceed to example number one so if f of x equals 3x minus 2 and g of x equals x squared plus 2x minus 3 find the quantity of f minus g times x so you need to uh, write the formula formula natin is uh, quantity of f minus g times x equals f of x subtract g of x next you need to substitute the value of f of x ano ba yung value ng f of x natin that is 3x minus 2 so that is 3x minus 2 subtract the value of g of x that is x squared plus 2x minus 3 then simplify okay tanggalin ng itong parenthesis na to sa first term or sa first expression 3x minus 2 then this one ito yung sign i-distribute mo yan sa each term of this expression so, negative times x squared, that is negative x squared. The negative times positive 2x. So, negative times positive magiging negative 2x. The negative, this one, sa so third term, this expression, negative times negative 3, so that is positive 3. Tandaan, negative times negative, the result is always positive. Next, you need to uh, combine like terms. So, ang like terms natin dito, the same variable and the same exponent. So, 3x and negative 2x. So, 3x minus 2x, that is x. Then, negative 2 and positive 3 so magiging ano yan negative 2 plus 3 so that is plus 1 and last itong negative x squared then i-arrange natin ano yung pinakataas na exponent mauna so negative x squared plus x plus 1 so ano yun, ito na yung Sagot natin, negative x squared plus x plus 1. Okay, so what if? Okay, for example, lagyan natin dito ng value ang x. So, find f minus g times x where x magiging where x equals positive 2. So, value ng x natin is positive 2. I-substitute lang natin yan dito. So, negative times positive 2 raised to 2 plus 2 plus 1 what if lang ito ha what if ito is 2 ito yung x is 2 so magiging negative times 2 raised to 2 that is 4 plus 2 plus 1 next so, negative times 4, that is negative 4 plus 3. So, the answer is negative 1. If the value of x is positive 2. Okay. Next. Pero, pag walang value ang x, the final answer is ito. Negative x squared plus x plus 1. Next. Example number 2. So, we have... Let f of x equals x squared minus 5 and g of x equals 5x plus 4. So, find letter A, 
quantity of f minus g times x so we need to find the value of the difference or the result so formula dito number 2 letter a so f minus g times x equals f of x subtract g of x again substitute natin yung value ng f of x yung value ng f of x natin is x minus 5 or x squared minus 5 rather than subtract the quantity lagyan natin ng quantity or parenthesis yung value ng g of x so that is 5 x plus 4 then simplify copy the first expression is x squared minus 5 then ito i-distribute natin isa-isa so negative times 5x so that is negative 5x the negative times positive 4 so magiging negative 4 then simplify your answer so x squared like terms negative 5 minus negative 4 that is negative 9 minus 5x is this your final answer no you need to arrange your uh, answer x squared minus 5x minus 9 okay so that is the final answer for letter a ito and so for letter b if the quantity of f minus g times 3 so the value of x is three so you need to substitute this one so we have formula f minus g times three equals f of x minus g of x so ang value ng x natin is three so substitute muna natin yung value ng f of x so ang value ng f of x is x squared minus 5 subtract the quantity of the value of g of x 5x plus 4 then simplify again distribute x squared minus 5 minus 5x minus 4 then simplify x squared magiging negative 5x then this one magiging negative 9 then equals the value of x is 3 so substitute 3 raised to 2 subtract 5 times 3 minus 9 then 3 times 3 that is 9 minus 15 5 times 3 minus 9 so we have anong sagot natin Okay, so we have, ang sagot natin is, okay, negative 15. Ito, ma-eliminate yung positive 9 and negative 9. So, ang result is, we have negative 15. Okay, ito na yung sagot natin. Okay, example number 3, we have, if of x equals x minus 5 over 3, x plus 7, and g of x equals 4x over 3x plus 7 find the quantity of f minus g times x so formula we have quantity of f minus g times x equals f of x subtract g of x g of x then substitute natin so the value of f of x is uh, x minus 5 over 3x plus 7 subtract quantity of 4x over 3x plus 7 then to find the difference of this given functions you need to find the LCD so ano yung LCD natin since the same yung denominator natin kopyahin lang natin yung denominator and add or subtract the value of the numerator so that is the rule in solving uh, fractions with the same denominator you need to copy the denominator and 
add or subtract the value of the numerator. So that is 3x plus 7. Okay. So 3x plus 7, divide mo yan sa 3x plus 7, ang answer niyan is 1. Times mo yan sa dito. x minus 5, subtract, that is 4x. 4x. Okay, next. You need to simplify. So that is uh, x minus 5 minus 4x over 3x plus 7. So, ang answer niyan is ito. x minus 4x magiging 3x. Negative 3x then copy yung negative 5 or minus 5 over 3x plus 7. Ito, like terms, ito, x minus 4x. So, the result is negative 3x. So, is this our final answer? Negative 3x minus 5 over 3x plus 7. Okay, so that is our final answer for number 3. Number 4, so we have if f of x equals x plus 3 and g of x equals x plus 2, uh, 7 over x minus 2. So find the quantity of f minus g times x. Again, formula natin is f minus g times x equals f of x subtract g of x. So, we have f of x, that is x plus 3, subtract quantity of x plus 7 over x minus 2. Then, find the LCD. So, ang LCD natin is yung denominator. So, ano yung denominator natin? So, understood na ang denominator dito is 1. So, ang LCD natin, x minus 2. So, x minus 2, i-divide natin yan sa 1. So, the result is, same pa rin, x minus 2. Times the value of the numerator, that is x plus 3, subtract x minus x minus 2, divide x minus 2, that is 1, times x plus 7, the value of the numerator, equals, simplify natin, so we have x times x, so magiging x squared, x times 3, so we have positive 3x, and negative 2 times x, so magiging negative 2x. The negative 2 times positive 3, magiging negative 6. Then ito i-distribute natin. So negative times x, magiging negative x. Negative times positive 7, magiging negative 7. Over x minus 2 equals, i-simplify natin, like terms, x squared, walang kapareha, so you just to copy, plus, ito, 3x minus 2x minus x. So, this one, understood na may 1, so 3 minus 2, magiging positive 1, minus 1 equals 0. So, eliminate na ito, eliminate, eliminate. So, ang remaining value natin is erase natin. Ang remaining value is x squared and negative 6 minus negative 7 that is negative 13 over x minus 2. So, this is our final answer x squared minus 13 over x minus 2. Next, we have number 5, last. 
So we have number 5. If f of x equals x squared plus 5x plus 4 and g of x equals x squared plus 2x minus 8, so find the difference. So formula f minus g times x equals f of x subtract g of x equals okay value ng f of x is x squared plus 5x plus 4 subtract value of g of x is x squared plus 2x minus 8 then equals kopyahin natin yung first ex expression 5x plus 4 then subtract this one distribute natin negative x squared negative this one negative 2x and negative times positive negative 8 that is positive 8 then simplify x squared minus x squared that is 0 eliminate na yan 5x minus 2x so that is 3x then ito magiging plus 12 ito na what if lagyan natin dito ang x is equals to uh, 2 or negative 2 so what is the value of the f minus g times x if x is negative 2 so substitute lang natin so 3 times negative 2 plus 12 so magiging negative 6 plus 12 so that is 6 so pag mayroong value ang x which is negative 2 pag walang value ang x automatically ito yung sagot substitute lang natin yung value ng x okay so that's all